like to be in year seven. In our day we have five different periods, two before break, two after break and one after lunch. This is a contact book. You get one at the start of the year. It holds lots of information like calendars, notes, timetables and maps. There's also a section for notes at the back where your parents and carers can write notes for your teachers. This is our school uniform. We wear lanyards and they have to be visible at all times. Your, your lanyard colour will be red. You also have to have a big enough backpack to carry all your books in. And you have to wear black leather shoes, you're not allowed trainers. The PE kit consists of a fleece, a t-shirt and bottoms. You could also have leggings or shorts. Uh, you need trainers as well and fleece is better for the winter months. In our school we have achievement points. You can earn those achievement points by showing good work and kindness to others. We also got a system called Class Charts where you can do your homework, so make sure you do it earlier. Green shows you just how long is left to fully charge. This is our library. There are lots of different genres of books to take out and you can take out two at a time. You can also help out to be a student librarian by issuing books to students at break and lunch. Hello, can I take this book out please? Yes, of course. What's your name? Silva. How do you spell it? S-I-L-V-E-R. You can thank you. You're welcome. Other than this library, we have many other amazing facilities, like our theatre and our sports hall, as well as the computer suite with amazing Apple Macs inside. After every break and lunch time, we line up in silence to wait for our teachers to come and collect us to take us to our lessons. So if for any reason they don't um, let you go at 12.15, just remind them that you are going on a trip. There's great pastoral support at Stoke Rinton School and if you're ever feeling sad or have problems with friends, uh, there are people you can always talk to. It's the one to the right. You've got to write up something called a business plan. The Year 7s have their own playground for both for lunch and when they want to get food they can go to the pod or the bluebird cafe. What I really like about Stockton Open School is that they accept everyone and that means you get to meet lots of people and make more friends. Uh, I really like the clubs, especially the music and drama clubs, because the teachers are really nice and they all really know what they're doing. I like Stalking because of how there's a lot of space to move around, as well as the teachers who are able to help you with your work, and LSAs for help with just general things in school. Um, I also like the trips you can go to on Creative Day. One of the best things about St. Newton School is the wide range of extracurricular activities that you can do at school. Um, I'm part of the, I'm a diversity lead, so it, we are a group that helps the school learn more about different communities. Like our last project was community evening, where we had like lots of different food and people from different cultures. The teachers are really nice and friendly, and they always like support you whenever you need help. Um, and also the canteen is a lot better than most primary schools in my opinion and when you go outside there's lots of options on what to do you can play basketball, you can uh, hang out with your friends, you can play fives um, and you can also go on the astro pitch. My favourite thing about Stoke Nainton Secondary School is the equipment that they provide you with that I would never think would be in a secondary school such as the 3D printer. My favourite thing about Stoke Newington is probably how welcoming and like how nice it seems on the first day and like the rest of the days of the year. What I like about Stoke Newington is that every piece of work that you do has different levels so all the work that you do is suited to you or pushes you 
further. The very good thing about Stokey is that mental and physical health is very highly prioritised and there's always support in the school if you need it. One of the things I like about staying here in school is it's easy to know where your lessons are and easy to get around. Some advice I'd give for a new year seven would be to like not feel scared when you're in the playground or not get like freaked out um, when you're making new friends because everyone's feeling like that. Don't worry about not finding your classes because it happens to all of us. Um, you learn it in a week or so anyway, so there's really no thing to worry about. The advice I would give for the new year sevens is like just obviously you know probably will know people coming from your primary school but everyone here is really really nice and they all just want to make new friends so interact with everyone rather than just staying with like the same people. One thing I was worried about when I joined the school was the bigger kids because they were much taller than me and it was kind of intimidating so a piece of advice that I have is not to be afraid of the bigger kids because they won't bother you and they're actually not bad people. You should just ask anyone like, there are a lot of supportive people there, and they'll just tell you where you need to be. Hi, I'm Mr Byrne, Head of Year 7. And I'm Miss Gluckstein, also Head of Year 7. We're going to be supporting you um, through the transition from primary to secondary school. And you might find it as like a scary and about being worried about it, but we're here to support you. There's lots of people here to support you. And we're all going to be here to make sure that it's a great transition. And there's loads of things uh, that you can look forward to in secondary school. There's loads of clubs, there's loads of activities, completely different school, so much going on. We're really looking forward to working with you. And we'll see you through the transition in year seven and right the way through year 11, and we're both really excited about working with all of you. We want you to be work as being as creative as possible and just try and enjoy your education.